What's up guys, it's Rock here, welcome back to Game of Cosmos. But today we have this game, this knockoff game called Fury Doom. And uh, it's it's not even really a knockoff game, it's a Dragon Ball game, but it's called Fury uh, Doom Cosmic Adventure. We're gonna go ahead and take a look at it, jump into it, show you guys what's fun about it, what's different about it, and uh, get some action on this gameplay and see what it is, if this is gonna be a game you guys wanna continue to see on the channel, if not, We'll go into it. So as you guys can see, we're introduced to Android 18. And uh, if you guys enjoy Dragon Ball Legends content, I try to do Dragon Ball Legends content every single day at 5 p.m. Central Time, as well as hit that notification bell to get notified as soon as I upload any anime gameplay like this. It's not Dragon Ball Legends, and let's get to 15 likes on today's video. So, like I said, you're introduced with this deal for Android 18. Now this has some idling aspects to it and it gives you some directions on how to complete things. Literally every single time you play, it gives you directions on how to do it. But you get to harvest what you have looted throughout the day. So we harvested that. You also get these for the amount of time it's going on. So in 12 hours, I redeem 3,000 of those. So here goes literally a campaign. You literally go into it, go. Tells you where to get. You go to maid, gives you instances resort instances and then we go ahead and go into this challenge see what we can do we're gonna go ahead and add Vegeta Android 20 and we're gonna come back see what happens hopefully some good happens it is idling so it's just all automatic it's different it's uh it's it's everything's automatic it's a good game to just have on the side if you want to there's still some testing I'm gonna do for the game so I'll be going diving down deeper into the game playing it for a little while see what it does and because uh, the developer is I'm going to be assuming a fan since this is not specifically straight up Dragon Ball there's a few other mobile games out there that are just like this like Lost Dragon Ball or Sand Warriors or Stick Warriors and, and there's a bunch of different ones if you guys want to see me get into that let me know in the comment section below and I'll definitely like to get into that for you guys but as you can see it's idling and we're getting into just literally auto battle and this is honestly if to think about it this is a true collector's game you don't really get to do much you get to add equipment and do little things here and there but it's literally idling the whole time anyways you can't specifically choose anything you get victory just like that you can look at your statistics if you choose to which tells you how you do stuff and, and how you did during that and what super ultimate attacks you've used and uh you can just raid this out and just keep doing that and doing that and doing that And there's just a bunch of the to this game, which we're actually gonna need to do another one of these. All right, we redeemed it after the raid. Why does it keep telling me to go back? We have a Videl stage. We have the Radis stage. Break instances, which is uh, you get some other stuff. You got this is uh, what is that? Z ore instances, which is Hercules, and Z crystal instances, which we haven't unlocked yet. We'll go ahead and challenge this. See how we do on this first map. Just get a feel for it. Should be fairly easy. The only thing I wish is that you could choose what to do. So you can strategize a little bit more. But I mean, it's an idling collector's game is what I can call it. You can do some summons on here. You can do a bunch of few different things, but and you get like this original Saiyan built for the game, so it, it's it's very different. I don't know how I feel about it yet, but I'm definitely gonna give it a little bit more time, play with it a little bit more, see if it's something worth it. And like I said, you do get to redeem some stuff as the game plays on. Like for example, I got first form cell as a character to have in my collection here. Is this is just idling it's just all that's all what this is okay it's gonna have us do this one so let's go against Bulma see what we do how we do so let's go ahead and bring TN in Dende is the healer for your team so he will definitely heal up your team fairly decently just like that we are done another finish victory finish and that'll be complete. Level 34 now. Get to unlock a few new things. Go ahead and go. We just did that. So we're gonna ignore that. See, it does that literally the whole time. So I would say maybe if they're watching, back off a little bit on telling us exactly what we need to do on every single thing. I appreciate it, but it's like, 
where's the fun in figuring things out if it's literally every single thing they have you do something new and then push you towards doing these things part of the game instead of having fun figuring it out all on your own there is a story mode thing here which you guys can see the boss battles Vegeta Kaioken twice Goku was useless to Vegeta so he decided to risk his life and triple it Kaioken <laughs> finally injured Vegeta and unwilling Vegeta made the moon and transformed into a giant ape English is not very great here but like I said this is looks like it's done by a fan so it's as good as it can get so we're gonna go ahead and switch out some of these characters redo this team we're gonna go ahead and Vegeta Goku Piccolo and then Tien. it's just one of those things just the idle collect characters not much to it it is what it is just wanted to show you guys a little bit about it let me know what you guys think if you guys want to see more content about this game I would love to do it if not I would let it be and then I would just delete it from the uh, from my apps but I mean just got super attacks here some ultimate attacks as you guys can see the spirit bomb that just went off and it's just an island game so you literally don't do anything really nothing you can increase the speed and that's about it other than that you collect your stuff move on level 35 but if you guys did enjoy this video this is just a little taste of what could come on this game um, I just wanted to share it with you guys to see if you guys have played this game before if you guys are interested in seeing more on the channel let me know other than that if you guys enjoyed today's video make sure you like subscribe and favorite share with a friend or two or three as always live free work hard and based on join me tomorrow for some more Dragon Ball Legends content bye guys for more daily content subscribe here if you want to see more of my daily life and behind the scenes stuff subscribe here if you want to see some other games i play click here also if you want to check out my main channel for dance videos topics and solo adventures click here also don't forget to hit that notification bell to get notified as soon as i upload new content on all my channels bye guys